What's good y'all, it's your boy Ross back here again with another video man. So I have a actual product unboxing and a review for you guys. So I just got some new LED RGB light panels. They're both 18.3 inches and I'm gonna try it out. I'm gonna see how the lighting improves on my recording setup and um, I'm looking forward to doing an unboxing for you guys in case you guys are interested in upgrading your lighting setup or just getting a lighting setup from the start. I do have one right now for myself. I only have one of the Elgato key lights and it's been very useful, but I definitely wanted to upgrade and see how a dual light setup would make uh, the improvements on my videos and in the lighting situation in my room. So we're going to check this out I'm gonna do a complete unboxing for you guys and I'm going to link down below where you can get this at so let's get right into it all right so it comes in this large large little case so i'm about to open it up or whatnot see how they packaged it up and uh we're gonna go from there open this bad boy up you can see it all right and you see that it comes with two panels or whatnot these are actually bigger than the ones that when i have my legato key light it's actually a nice size 18.3 inches okay this right here So the one I have on my desk is literally just clamped onto the back of it. But apparently these come with two, uh, I'm guessing, tripods. And they seem heavy duty, so it's going to be interesting to see how I try to set this up. But uh, so far, um, I'm, I'm looking forward to seeing how this, this all comes out. It seems pretty self-explanatory on how to set things up. It did come with an instruction manual. Uh, I know you can control the RGB light setup and the settings, the brightness and the colors and stuff through your smartphone. So I'm going to set that up later. Um, but yeah, it's pretty self-explanatory when it comes to just attaching, you know, the attachments and stuff like that. Setting up the tripod if you've ever set one up. But if you do have any confusion, it does come with some instruction manuals to potentially help you out. So let me continue just setting up the lights. That was pretty simple. It just kind of locks into place and if you want to remove it you just press the button and uh, slide it down slide it up and slide it down and you'll be able to unlock it as you can see i got them set up and uh, i have them actually connected to my phone in the uh manual book um there's an option where you can download the app and this is the app right here let me scroll out of it so you guys can see and when it clear up this is the newer app right here and the cool thing is it's easy to find it because it's over bluetooth over my phone cool thing is i can group them together and change the effects of uh of like the lighting together instead of individually for example when i switch over to the, my devices i can go into this and switch it up manually and the same here i can go in here and switch it up manually but when i group them together any effects that I change to them or whatnot, they happen simultaneously. So for example, I want to turn down the brightness because I think they're a little bit too bright. So I'm going to turn them down. And as you can see, both of them got much dimmer. If I want to turn the brightness up, just move this across. And now they're both much brighter. If I want to turn down the brightness and maybe change the color, the tint of it. Now you see I'm gonna move it over. It's a little bit of a more of a bluish tint. I wanna change it back over this way. Now it's more of a warm tint. I can also mess around with this as well. Scroll this over, it gives it more of a green hue. You probably can't tell too too much, but you can possibly tell within just the background lighting. Now it's more of a red tint. And cool thing is you can just press these little side buttons here plus and minus to incrementally change it. You don't have to change too much or whatnot. Then they have some other settings here. This is pretty cool. It's, now it's all this blue tint. It's a color wheel. 
you can increase the brightness increase it decrease it how much hue you want on it here's like some purple lights right here you can also decrease the saturation on it hey i want to have a red color for whatever reason or pinkish red or maybe an orange or a yellow and i'm just moving across the wheel and it's changing the colors which i do like my other key light didn't have that feature of me just being able to change the colors at a you know moment's notice which i do like i can go to the center give it a pure white look or whatnot but i like this this is this is actually pretty cool and intuitive then you can go to the scenes and now i got the flashing going or whatnot the paparazzi sorry for those who have uh you know uh potential epilepsy sorry about that you have this section right here i'm not sure what that is defective bulb an explosion that's crazy welding sorry about that <laughs> um cct flash there's a hue flash and then there's like a pulsing mode where it brightens up, dims and brightens up. So I don't think I'm really be using too much of this. I don't think I really need that. <laughs> I'll probably just keep it on lighting for the most part. Sorry about the flashing y'all. <laughs> but I'm just trying to mess around with it just so you guys can get an idea. So I'm probably gonna go with this right here. Just let me lower it all the way. This is pretty much off and I'll probably have it to like maybe right here. I don't think I need it too bright. Uh, I may change the hue just a little bit to like maybe like right here or whatnot. And I think this is a good light setting. So yeah, man, this is this is I'm I'm loving this. Just how much control I have just through my phone. I'm loving this so much, and I'm I'm liking the lighting setup. So I'm gonna place the camera where I normally would record at, so you guys can see how it would possibly look in my future videos. So. I'm not gonna lie to you. This is the new lighting setup. I actually like the way it looks on camera Hopefully you guys can tell the difference from what it was from using just one um, Key light setup or RGB light setup to having two and I can control with my phone I can change the colors set up different scenes and the cool thing about this if I want to have an impromptu photo shoot Guess what? I can. This is what the dual light setup is for. I can actually maybe get get a backdrop or whatnot and have an impromptu uh, photo shoot, man. So uh, I'm liking this. I, just now looking at it on camera, bro, it, it actually just looks better for me personally. I don't know if you guys can tell the difference. Lighting is very important when you're making videos. That is one of the things that's going to help you, especially if you're trying to create some great content that is visually appe appealing. And I like this, man. This is this is cool. It's crazy how far I've come from recording literally with a Walmart lamp. I literally got a Walmart lamp for my very first like recording setup for my personal page many years ago. If you remember that, comment down below. And now I have a nice RGB light setup that I can control with my phone. And I, I'm, I'm cool with this, man. This is this is a nice addition to the recording room, man. So uh, let me know down below if you guys are liking the new light setup, the lighting setup, and if you guys are uh, looking forward to the, the videos with the new lighting. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm looking forward to testing this out and uh, seeing what your guys' reactions to this actual video is. So what I need y'all to do, go down in, it's gonna, I'm gonna link it down in the description where you can get this product from and i'm gonna link it pin it down in the comments down below uh i was able to get this on amazon so definitely check it out or whatnot now i will say this it may be a little bit over your budget you know if that's the case but i do think this is worth the investment if you want to have a nice quality lighting setup i think uh, the best choice is to go with newer the dual light setup man and it's it's really nice simple it didn't even take me long to set this up literally a few minutes and everything was set up it's self-explanatory i didn't really have to use the manual too much other than setting up the app and stuff like that that literally took a few minutes and i'm gonna be messing around with more of the settings and colors and stuff like that just to play around with it so i def definitely do think it's worth your money man 
go get this if you're definitely trying to increase your lighting setup whether it's you're streaming doing music you know like youtube reactions or whatever you're doing or even if you just want something at a studio space to potentially uh set up photo shoots i think you can't go wrong with these lights so appreciate you guys just checking out this uh unboxing i will actually be doing some more unboxing for future things i plan on getting um for the office setup so if you guys uh, are interested in that be on the lookout for some more unboxings on the way but appreciate you guys kicking with me and i'll see y'all on the next one peace